Hello, I am Marina Zapoter and I help management teams create and protect what their core stakeholders value. Today I want to talk about my observation that many people experience formal risk management as a chore. They have to attend workshops in which they are asked to think about what could go wrong. They have to vote on likelihoods and effects of possible events with negative consequences. And then they have to update their list of risks on a regular basis and submit them to headquarters. You probably recognize this from your own practice. That doesn't sound, look and feel great, right? How nice would it be if your team could get rid of this compliance-driven approach for dealing with uncertainty? As a result, it would allow you to better deal with opportunities and threats as part of your regular business. Never just talk about risk in the sense of potential events with negative consequences for what your stakeholders value. Think in terms of opportunities and threats as they always go hand in hand. A new customer can contribute to your margin, but can also turn out to be a major collection problem. Approach dealing with uncertainty from the perspective of line and project managers. It's all about looking ahead and making consequence conscious decisions. And only talk about opportunities and threats in the context of an important decision. Saying goodbye to a poorly performing supplier offers great advantages, but obviously also possible disadvantages. So whenever your team has to make an important decision, discuss the relevant pros and cons. Talk about the likely effects of your different options for your core stakeholders. Every team is tasked with delivering products or services that meet the requirements and expectations. Value management helps your team to better deal with divergent stakeholders' interests and allocating your scarce time, attention and other resources. Feel free to contact me if you want to discuss specific challenges of your team. I look forward to hearing from you.